Hey guys, welcome to a little nighttime shopping at TJ Maxx slash Home Goods. We're actually shopping for me today, so we're just gonna kind of go through things I want to look at and see if we can find a couple little things I'm looking for. And I hope you enjoyed this shopping trip. This is pretty little pink and brown Michael Kors. It's 130, but it is pretty cute. Oh, and this little hot pink number here. $70, it must be Calvin Klein, I'm assuming. Is it Calvin Klein? Yep, it surely is. Day and mood. This little crossbody leather, 430. It's so little, it's so cute. What is this one? It looks like a diaper bag. Skip hop. I think that is a diaper bag. That's pretty stinking cool. It's big. Hmm. So you guys in need of a diaper bag? Try your local TJ Maxx. I don't think any of my viewers have babies. Or do you? Let me know down below because I was thinking most of them are past the baby stage. But it's very possible that some of you still have a wee ones at home. And if you do, let me borrow them, would ya? I don't have any more at my house. <laughs> Just kidding. No, I'm kidding. That'd be kind of cool. Have a little little tiny to hang out with. Little Radley London. It's smaller size and it's 70 and it looks like a faux croc. Pretty cute. pretty. It's leather embossed. It looks like they're kind of trying to take after maybe Patricia Nash with a little bit of an edge to it with the silver hardware on it. Um, this little bad boy would be $70. Here's a Steve Madden satchel with kind of um, a shiny gun metal for $45. This is kind of like a really small carry-on. Too big for a purse. It's probably like the size of a Speedy 40, I would think. But it's kind of neat looking for $45. Bucks. Kind of cool. It's a little polka dot wallet by Mar from Maurice's. It's got rose gold zipper on it and it's only $7.99. Little tassel. Isn't that cute? Here's what it looks like inside. Pretty basic, but cute indeed. I'm looking for a little teapot that I fall in love with for my she shed for when one of my girlfriends comes over and we can just sit in there and have tea together. So that's what I'm looking for right now. Is it something adorable? You don't even know. Is there like, is, oh, hey, that might be Ray Dunn. Let's see, is it? It is. It's a little Ray Dunn teapot. They might have to do something like that. That's cute. Um, unless I find something that I find is a little bit more cute. I don't know what I'm looking for, actually. I'm just kind of looking, you guys, till something stands out. Like, that's pretty to me. That's really cute. And then I also am gonna get two little um, matching teacups, I'm hoping. There's some little teacups down here with the saucers, the English table. But first, first priority is finding the teapot and then finding the matching cups. Oh my gosh, look at this one. Oh wow, that's too big though, but isn't that pretty? Gosh, let's see, what do we have over here? What is this little guy? Kind of cute. And these are like little hanging to hang up. That's cute. So let's see what's down her. I don't see much down here. So let's take it over here. Oh, little creamer. That's sweet. This to me looks too old lady. So I'm not into that. Oh, sorry if somebody loves that. I'm sorry, but it looks reminds me of like a real great grandma type of mug. Watch, I'll end up getting something like that because I'll be all oh, it's so beautiful. I have to have that one. I'm not seeing anything right this second. A little one. That's so cute. Like, what kind of mug would you get to go with that though? Isn't that pretty? That's kind of cool. How much is this? It's by Coco and Lola. And it's probably on the bottom. Yeah, it's, oh, no, I don't want that one. I'm not paying $25. Okay, 
here I'll show you the redone stuff kind of um, goodies hanging out looks like the same stuff that's always have oh look at for my doggies treats live love bark that's stinking cute how much is that $9.99 I'm gonna get this for my baby dogs super cute okay that's not what I came for Ken but that's when you find stuff when you're not looking for it right exactly get something like plain white but that's boring nobody wants to be boring no plain white nope what is this over here what about that one is that too old lady you guys see that might be a little too old lady for me too no price I don't see a price on that one Jeez, I never thought I'd be picky over a teapot what in the world there's a black and a white one with, mm, I don't like that one. Nope, that's not my style either. Here's one with little poppies on it. I don't like the colors. Oh, for crying out loud. Well, here's a little, here's a, two little saucers that go with that one um, teapot right here. Maybe I'll do something like that, because I do like those. They're kind of cute. $6.99 per plate. And then there's all these little goodies here. Just thought I would show you why I'm over here. There's this little set here. Um this little guy here. Here's this. And here's this. So there's that for you if you're interested in any of that. Okay, so here's this one with little butterflies on it. It's six, only six ninety nine. That's pretty. So this is really good for um, your roots of your hair to give you volume. So I'm going to be getting one of these. And then I also, I love the Batiste dry shampoo. And you get a much bigger bottle here for $8.99. And they're like 7 I think, at Target for the smaller size, which is $4.50 here. So I'm going to get a large one of those too. How cute is this? It's a lipstick power bank. Is it real lipstick or is it just a power bank? Nope. That's really cute though. Eight dollars. Huh. What kind of colors do they have here? Lip glosses. There's a bunch of beauty blenders. Wow, they're really soft. That's kind of cool idea. And it is. Where's the price? Oh, $12.99 for all of these by Bella Beauty. Interesting. Flawless Blend by Urban Studio. I don't know what makes one any better than the other, though. I really don't on these. Hmm. Elf eyeshadow. gloss but it's actually a smooth matte eyeshadow and brown cashmere and it's three dollars these kind of colors look good on blue eyes like browns and rusts and actually maroons and stuff like that really makes blue eyes pop so I wonder hmm. probably works pretty good I would imagine Okay guys, so I'm gonna have a great haul for you um, tomorrow after you see this video because I found lots of stuff I was looking for, lots of stuff I wasn't looking for. So I'm just piling it all in my cart right now. Or in my car, not my cart. And yeah, so what do I have got? Three bags and a very large, uh, get this out, gotta be careful with that. And yeah, that is it, you guys. So until I see you on tomorrow's vlog, here's our haul for tomorrow. Stay humble, stay kind. Bye, guys.